Breaking. Lagos CP order security beef up following MC Oloma suspension. Welcome to the news end. Please subscribe to our channel. The Lagos State Commissioner of Police Abiodu Alabi has directed all area commanders and divisional police officers to beef up security and maintain visibility in their area of coverage. This is coming on the heels of the indefinite suspension of a Lagos State Chapter Chairman of the National Union of Road Transport Workers, NURTW, Musili Akinsai, and popularly known as MC Oloma, over alleged misconduct, insubordination, and inciting members of a state chapter against the apex, apex body. The state police boss, in an interview with Channel Television and Tews on Thursday, said the directive had been given on the deployment and pat patrol of all motor parks across the state. He assured Lagos residents of adequate security of life and property. The National Union of Road Workers Transport Workers, NURTW, was suspended earlier today, and the police boss said the move was necessary to curb any form of violence that may arise. The transport union also directed MC Olomo to immediately hand over the mantle of leadership to his deputy chairman and release all property belonging to the body in his possession to state secretary in a bid to avoid any leadership vacuum in the state. Hey, hey. Lagos State is coming out to say they should not worry. Ah, Lizzo, Lagos so I hope you people are listening. No, it's not going to be funny. We all know how MC Olomo can be. Hey, hey, hey. This is when we are going to find out what people have been talking about. Yes, this is what we are going to find out. You know, everybody is like, you know, saying that um, this guy, so Loma, he's like him, um, the most right hand man in Lagos State when it comes to things being done. No wonder he actually was given the mantle. I think there was, there was a time it was rumored that he's, he was given the Oba, was crowned the Oba for sure. I don't know if that is actually correct. The people in Lagos should help us verify. And then we started hearing that he was crowned, he was given the position of, you know, uh, huh, one uh, position like that. Last week we heard that, you know, um, um, so Loma was given one position by the NDLEA, anti drug, whatever, whatever. And my mouth flies. We are almost entering into my mouth. When I heard it, I was like, ah, how? Has somebody who knows how to do the job, has somebody who is an expert or what exactly is going on? So, <laughs> this will bring us uh, everything we are talking about, you know. Let's see how this plays out. Let's see how it all plays out. Make everybody enter house on time, oh. <laughs> this is my people, eh? Ah, that, just what I'm saying. Forget what in police, don't talk. People we should, as in Lagosians, please, go home on time to avoid the bus bus. Before we see the concern, you will not touch person. Okay? Because of ordinary tout. He should be simply bundled into the detention if he tries to cause any commotion in the state. Is he above the law? Yes, he's above the law. Ha! Anybody affiliated to Tunumbu these days is above the law. Hmm. Okay. The law is not a respecter of anybody. I believe the body that regulates the conduct and job descriptions of a said union can discipline those find wanting in due course of their duty. <laughs> okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of the day.